Hey guys, thanks for clicking on the video again. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to take a keycad design as is and just import it to Altium. So this might be a scenario where you have started at, with PCB design and you use software like keycad and you made so many designs, but now you have gone a level up and you're working for a company and now you have Altium and all that work you've done, you don't want to lose. So what you want to do is import your keycad to Altium easy peasy and this video will show you how to do it. So first thing we have to do is on the top right you'll see your icon of user information. If you click on that you'll get extensions and updates. Uh, as you can see there's nothing here. Uh, then you can purchase. Don't be scared it is a free add-on. Uh, yeah, you can type in keycad here if you want uh, but you can see it's there. Keycad importer. We just download it. Uh, should not take too while, too long, and I will tell you, you need to restart Ultimate Designer to complete this install. Okay, it's going to restart. So once your Ultimate has restarted, uh, we can import our KiCad project just by going File, Import Wizard, Next, and then you'll see it should pop up here, KiCad Design Files, Next. Uh, you'll just add the project you want to do. So I'm going to use the same example of battery charger uh, that we used in our previous video. Guys, just so you know, all our PCB designs that we do is available on GitHub. If you want the GitHub link, uh, just join our Discord. Our Discord's below in the links below. Our Discord's basically where we all chat uh, as a community about the designs we're doing, helping each other. So all the designs we do as, as Plumpot uh, is freely available to everyone. So this battery charger, for instance. But let's just use this example. So we're going to take this as a project, open, and then we'll go through its stuff. Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. Uh, seems alright. Uh, I don't want to use the keycats colors. I want to use the Altium colors. Yeah, it's just text. The font you can change if you really want to. It's not that important. It just breaks up all the layers, and now it starts importing. And I'm quite impressed how quick it does it, and I. How accurate it does it. Look at that, it's already there. So you can see a PCB we had in Altium, oh, in KiCad, sorry, is now available in Altium. Um, as you can see, the 3D files don't get taken over. Uh, so there is some stuff you'll have to do. And I'm missing my schematic. So it seems like the PCB came through okay. Oh, shucks, that's not locked. Um, but it seems the schematic something's up. So while doing this video, I found out something very interesting. So I've done this import with other projects before, but now it seems that the schematic is totally blank. It seems that in KiCad, I've got a picture of the battery charging circuit that I used as a reference. And when you have an image, it's not converting properly. So when I delete this, and I save this, and I go back to Altium, File, Import Wizard, uh, next, keycad, add, and then just the schematic, and then it seems to be fine. So it seems like you can't convert if there's an image PNG JPEG already pasted in. So if you see there, there's my pot, my thing, all perfect. So let's just move this to our project. I'm going to delete this, remove. So you see, uh, let's also just check that there's a like this arrow there that means it's a shortcut, it's not really in it. So we should rather do it correct. So that will be fixed when you save it as. Um, so you can see there's my, my PCB, there's my schematic. But you can see that we lost our 3D step files. So the downside is there is some stuff you'll have to redo. So these components aren't always fully uh, up to date when you take it over but this will work so this is still a proper pcb you'll be able to make gerbers if you want to convert it to altium fully there is some stuff you'll have to do but as you can see this works as supposed to uh, you can edit the footprints then if you want to add the 3d back i'll make a new other video on how to make the footprints but that's basically just quickly how to take your keycad uh, quick and easy to altium so that you can use it in Altium for the future for, for future references. 
And that's that, guys. Um, if you guys enjoy just learning a bit more about PCB design with Altium and KiCad, uh, please think about liking, subscribing to our channel. And then we'll make videos like this, just explaining in simple terms, um, easy steps to make your own PCBs, tips and tricks about what to do, how to do it. And yeah, so if, like I said earlier, if you guys want to join our Discord channel, just click on the link below and then join the community where we chat about all different things, about drones and uh, gaming and whatever you want to talk about, we can talk about. But the main goal is just helping each other with our hobbies and becoming makers. Guys, have a fantastic night. Uh, till next time.